Time for sports. Mars here with that. My. Taking you to the pool today, Hudson. It is playoffs in the pool. The UVic Vikes are headed to Canada West Championships in Edmonton, albeit with a more junior squad than last year. UVic swimmers, though, don't often do their best work in the pool. World champion Greg Streppel, World Cup veteran Carly Stutzel, current Olympic hopeful Richard Weinberger have all made their mark in open water, just like rookie Zach Parks. Jordan Cunningham has more. He came to us from diving, actually. Um, broke his arm on the diving board, decided that wasn't a great sport. 15 minutes before the opening ceremonies of age groups, I ended up breaking my arm. It turned out, though, to be a lucky break for Zach, who's jumped in with both feet to Peter Vigioli's Uvic Vikes, harnessing his raw talent, is Vigioli's vision. He's got a lot of speed for an open water guy at uh, the junior level. He's won the 50 free uh, at age group nationals a number of times, uh, but he hasn't really been able to translate that to the 100, the 200, and the 400. Zach's first event at the Canada West Championships in Edmonton is the 1500 meter, and while that's the longest event you'll swim in an Olympic pool, it's nothing compared to what Zach is used to as an open water swimmer. You do a lot more mileage, a lot more just training. Open water is also swam in the ocean, lakes, rivers. And in the deep come the dangers. I've actually got a scar from being punched in the face when I was in Mexico. So I was really scared too because there's already two shark attacks that year in the place where we were swimming. So this is easy. Oh, this, is, this is way easier. I don't have to worry about sharks or anything. No sharks, but plenty of podium predators await this weekend. Last year's Vikes team boasted world-class swimmers like Hillary Caldwell, Stephanie Horner, and Olympic bronze medalist Ryan Cochran. Being an Olympic year, they're saving their best strokes for Olympic trials. This year's Vikes have their eyes on improvement. It's a good experience for them to actually try to, you know, be independent and find the performance for themselves. The 2012 Olympics in open water is a possibility for Zach, but 2016 is a more realistic goal. But you never know. I could do really well, and who knows? Jordan Cunningham, CTV Sports, UVic.